Pajadores in Argentina were telling their stories while playing guitars. I am going to tell my story with my double bass. My story is about love, of course. He was a lazy and selfish patient who didn't appreciate the pure love. She was a virgin and beautiful, but very poor. This girl will be my double bass. I will talk and play. I was living for one year in Buenos Aires. The city attracted me. It fascinated me. Of course, living in Buenos Aires also made me want to dance tango. And as Buenos Aires sucked me in, tango did as well. So I decided to take tango classes. And then I was dancing tango in dark and gloomy milongas. And then, all of a sudden, it stopped. I'll tell you my full story. I am a dancer, and I've always dreamt about the most beautiful dress in the world. Because even when I was little, I never got to play with Barbie dresses. And the princesses of my movies did not wear princess dresses. And even when I did my first communion in Spain, I did not get a beautiful puffy dress. So I came up with a plan to get my dress. I only needed a boyfriend and a wedding dance. And the dance would be, of course, a tango. But that was only the beginning of my life plan. Tango is about love, about human passions, about what happens between a man and a woman. When people wanted to talk about love, they wrote poems, they wrote music, they made pieces of art. Because love is something that cannot be taught. It's a personal journey. Tango. I came here to share a short love story with you. A short story that helped me learn a lot of things about myself and about my own personal journey. Tango professionally is an exciting activity. However, it is a very demanding and challenging task. Tango is an improvisation dance, but filmmakers prefer repeatable actions. Of course, when something is repeated, it's not any more improvisation. How to solve such a conflict during shooting? While filming tango, I have discovered even more serious problems. I was witnessing a dangerous attitude and bad social behavior. For example, in front of Van Gogh Museum in Amsterdam. I will reveal those stories at the Milonga Only. (laughs) 